I heard Morgan on the radio. You heard Wilder Days. I heard, I heard Wilder Days. Truth is, you know, Jeff, um, his mouth does get him into trouble. He knows that. Are currently separated. Okay. Uh, we are not talking about divorce. The paparazzi asked her straight up, is she in a relationship with Morgan Wade? Are you dating Morgan Wade? Her friends told her who I was. My friends freaked out. And I was like, oh. Kyle and I plant the story in order to create uh, ratings, in order to create all kinds of different things. At the absurdity of all the rumors going around that she's a lesbian and that she's on Ozempic, right. I simply meant it as a joke. In an interview with Page Six while driving her car, Kyle Richards clarified the situation and said her friendship with Wade is just that, a friendship. But is it true? Intrigue surrounding a Real Housewives marriage. Kyle Richards, well known for her role in Bravo's Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, has found herself in the midst of a gossip storm. Questions are arising about the possible involvement of rising country music star Morgan Wade in the separation of Kyle and her husband, Mauricio Umansky. The intrigue began when Kyle posted a carousel of pictures on her Instagram with the caption, Life Lately. What caught everyone's eye was the absence of Mauricio in these photos. Instead, the images prominently featured Morgan Wade, a talented singer known for her hit song, Psychopath. I heard Morgan on the radio. You heard Wilder Days. I heard, I heard Wilder Days. I mean, there's tons of speculation going around with you and your relationship with Kyle. Can you clear it up for us once and for all? On Instagram, and I was like, oh, you know, I don't know. I don't, I had the tattoos and everything, I wasn't expecting all that. She was scared. All over town, amidst all the drama and headlines surrounding her, and that is Kyle Richards. One picture showed Kyle and Morgan taking a post-workout mirror selfie, while another featured them on vacation in Aspen, Colorado, happily posing for a selfie. The absence of Mauricio in these photos raised eyebrows and led to speculation about the state of Kyle's marriage. Kyle and Morgan's friendship has been blossoming for about a year now. Their connection became even more evident when Kyle accompanied Morgan as her date to the Americana Music Awards in September 2022. Since then, the two have traveled to various destinations together, from Mexico with friends to visiting Morgan's relatives in Atlanta. Sharp-eyed fans also noticed a curious detail both Kyle and Morgan appeared to be wearing rings that looked identical. And I, so I followed her, and then I kept listening to her music on like repeat, and I was like, wow, this girl is really blowing me away with her voice and the lyrics. And, and then she sent me a DM asking me why I was following her. I've done several music videos, and every time there's someone in it with me. Kyle's switch from her diamond ring to a silver band in March was followed by Morgan wearing a similar silver band the following month. Adding to the intrigue, both women seem to have matching heart tattoos, suggesting a deeper connection. During an Instagram Live session with Kyle's half-sister Kathy Hilton, there was a cryptic reference to their close bond. Kathy hinted at a little secret, which visibly surprised both Kyle and Morgan. Kyle swiftly changed the topic, leaving fans to speculate about what that secret might be. Despite their separation, sources revealed that Kyle and Mauricio are still living together under the same roof as they navigate their family's future. They share three daughters, Alexia, 27, Sophia, 23, and Portia, 15, adding complexity to their relationship dynamics. Kyle and I are human beings, okay? Mm -hmm. We have emotions, we have feelings, we're going through a really hard time. They always assume we're dating or we're, you know, something's going on. Are currently separated. Okay. Uh, we are not talking about divorce. You know, it's hard enough with people saying things about me. Kyle Richards appeared unfazed by the rumors surrounding her marriage. She explained that her decision not to wear her wedding ring was based on concerns for her safety and comfort. As the rumors continue to circulate, fans and followers are eagerly awaiting the next season of Real Housewives of Beverly Hills to see how this real-life drama unfolds. Is Morgan Wade truly at the center of Kyle's marital issues, or is there more to the story? Only time will reveal the truth. Parisian escapade fuels rumors. A stroll through the romantic streets of Paris has set the rumor mill on fire, intensifying speculations about a clandestine romance between reality TV star Kyle Richards and country singer Morgan Wade. The tantalizing saga unfolded when the former Real Housewives of Beverly Hills sensation shared a mesmerizing video on her Instagram story. 
The clip captured the duo sauntering along a picturesque bridge in the city of love, setting tongues wagging and hearts racing as reported by Page Six. In the video, Kyle Richards exuded an air of mystery, clad in an all-black ensemble, holding the camera with a playful smirk dancing on her lips. Beside her, Morgan Wade, the 28-year-old songstress of Wilder Days, sported a plaid shirt and rebelliously ripped jeans, her expression steadfast and her allure magnetic. On the internet, you see people who are obsessed with you know, us being friends and why we're friends and you know, why they I would be friends with you. The paparazzi asked her straight up, is she in a relationship with Morgan Wade? Are you dating Morgan Wade? Her friends told her who I was. My friends freaked out. And I was like, oh. Of course, this video surfaced and it's the first time she's spoken out since the Morgan Wade rumors. While the Instagram story set screens ablaze, Morgan Wade's personal Instagram remained conspicuously devoid of any snapshots featuring the 54-year-old reality TV icon. It was a subtle detail that further fueled the simmering intrigue. But that's not all. The rendezvous in the City of Lights was merely a prelude to their alleged romance, as the duo was reportedly spotted at a cozy cafe in the heart of Saint Germain de Pre. I like the your big, I like when you were wearing the loofah earlier. Yeah, was. <laughs> Kyle and I plant the story in order to create uh, ratings, in order to create all kinds of different things. I like you beeping through them blinds up there because it was making me laugh every time I see her. <laughs> Their meeting was no ordinary affair, according to local eyewitness Chelsea Gerard. She revealed that Kyle and Morgan arrived independently but gravitated toward each other, settling at an intimate table inside. Their closeness was palpable, with the two constantly leaning in even when not speaking. Gerard described the encounter as very intimate, citing playful touches and body language that spoke volumes, far from the demeanor of just two friends. This juicy saga began with their conspicuous matching tattoos and rings, raising eyebrows as they were frequently seen together, coinciding with Kyle's separation from her husband Mauricio. As a matter of fact, at the time that the story came out from People.com, Kyle and I were not separated. But we thought it would be, you know, kind of a good idea and kind of poke fun at that. Um, and we're dealing, we're trying to deal with this stuff internally, with, with ourselves. Kind of troll the trolls a little bit. The internet's going to be popping off about this one, I'm sure. Adding to the intrigue, Kyle featured alongside the country sensation in Wade's music video for the song fall in love with me, where they portrayed lovers. In an August 4 promo video for the same song, the duo cheekily addressed the controversy surrounding their relationship. You see people being obsessed with us being friends and why we're friends, Wade coyly remarked in the promo, while Richards added, if they're gonna talk, you might as well give them something to talk about. As the story unfolds amidst the enchanting backdrop of Paris, fans and curious onlookers are left awaiting the next chapter of this captivating tale of love, friendship, and secrets in the glitzy world of celebrity. Mysterious Airport Reunion In the world of celebrity intrigue, the drama surrounding Kyle Richards and country singer Morgan Wade continues to unfold. The latest chapter in this captivating story occurred when Kyle was spotted waiting for Morgan Wade at the Los Angeles International Airport. The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star arrived in a sleek black Range Rover ready to pick up the enigmatic Virginia-based songwriter. Morgan, known for her hit Wilder Days, approached the car donned in a black Max Effort shirt, matching pants and eye-catching sneakers, all while maintaining a low profile beneath sunglasses and a camouflage hat. As for Kyle, the 54-year-old reality TV icon sported black shades, exuding an air of mystery while sitting behind the wheel in a leather jacket. The airport rendezvous adds another layer of intrigue to their already enigmatic connection. This meeting came hot on the heels of a bombshell moment in the Bravo show's season 13 trailer, where Kyle and her estranged husband, Mauricio Umansky, addressed cheating rumors in a light-hearted kitchen conversation. Mauricio playfully quipped, I'm just glad it's you out there having an affair, with a sly reference to speculation about Kyle's connection with Morgan Wade. In response, Kyle coyly retorted, for once, it's me. What is going on, Kyle? I'm just glad it's you out there having an affair. For once, it's me. And we were dealing with our own issues internally, and it all came out, and et cetera, et cetera. That story has made us a lot stronger. Yeah. Okay, well, you sneeze, and there's 45 articles about it. So, well, if they're going to talk, you might as well give them something to talk about. They talk about that right now. 
I just want you to know. I don't want to talk about it. Later in the trailer, the couple reassured their tearful daughters that they are a strong family and that nothing can change that. The enigmatic Wade also made an appearance, claiming that she and Kyle met because the Bravo Liberty stalked her and even got a tattoo of the first letter of Richard's name on her body. Despite recent statements, including Mauricio's assertion that they were not separated during a Red Mike interview, the waters remain muddy. Mauricio later clarified to TMZ that they are currently separated but not talking about divorce. Look, it's, uh, we are, I will say it again, we are separated. Uh, we are not throwing in the towel. Very hard when everybody interprets everything you said. When I answered the question on that podcast, we're not just saying that for the sake of, you know, of you guys or everybody in the news to like pretend like we are not yet. Have conversations with our kids. We've had conversations with our family. That's actually brought us closer together and it's been really, really nice. Kyle herself confirmed the separation during a paparazzo encounter and was subsequently photographed looking emotional, seeking solace from friends during a hike. Adding a twist to the narrative, one month after her friend Jeff Lewis jokingly speculated on Watch What Happens Live that Kyle is not straight, Jenna Lyons, a star of Real Housewives of New York, shared similar speculations on the Who What Where podcast. I think Kyle's coming over to my team, she mused. I think she needs a little bit of help. Do you regret anything that was said or do you feel like you said what you said? Um, and you just expect your friends not to and then I have to like... At the absurdity of all the rumors going around that she's a lesbian and that she's on Ozempic, right. I simply meant it as a joke. Truth is, you know, Jeff, um, his mouth does get him into trouble. He knows that. No way! Well, do you think that she's upset with you? I don't know. I hope not. As the saga continues, Fans and gossip enthusiasts can't help but be drawn into the web of secrets, affairs, and unexpected twists in the glamorous world of Hollywood. That's all for this video, folks. See you next time.